Well, good morning, Dean Buddha from In His Image Ministries in Durban. I've been talking about the living water, the living well, which is Jesus Christ and the Samaritan woman making her way up to the well, um, wanting to drink water, sustain herself and her household. Have you ever thought about the level of dissatisfaction that she was experiencing in her life? I mean, she was dissatisfied with relationships. She hadn't been able to find a relationship with a man that satisfied her. And so she'd constantly moved on. She wasn't satisfied with her cultural experience. She wasn't satisfied with the enmity in her life. She wasn't satisfied with the religious experience going up to the mountain. It didn't seem to satisfy her. I wonder what level of dissatisfaction you have. See, we, we can go to a place, go to a fellowship, and yet we haven't met the wellspring of life. We've joined a group. We've fulfilled all their rites of passage, of acceptance. But we come with our buckets empty and we go with our buckets empty or we go with some water that keeps us for a short while. But it didn't satisfy us because only the living water that comes from the living spring that eternal life can satisfy the dissatisfaction. Are you dissatisfied with some of the relationships that they haven't worked out? Have you placed a burden on yourself that it was you, that despite all your best efforts, you're drinking from the well of the bitterness of your own failure? of recrimination? What buckets are you bringing to the Lord today? Because only He can say to me, ask of me and I'll give you living water to drink and you will thirst no more. So this dissatisfaction, it needs to be handed to the Lord. We need to hand it to Him and say, Lord, this thirst has gone on for too long and nothing I do can satisfy it. Would you give me the living water to drink so that I can thirst no more? If we're going to come to Christ, we want to walk away satisfied. We want to walk away with that thirst removed. We don't want a temporary fix. We want a complete fix. And only the living water satisfies us. So... Why don't you take your dissatisfaction to the Lord today and let him fill you with living water.